All right, in this video, I'm going to show you another skill that comes in handy a lot on the GRE, and it's just called translating words into math. You know, a lot of times we're going to see a word problem. And the big challenge in a word problem of any kind usually is like, well, hey, what math can we turn this into? You know, a word problem doesn't really have uh, you know an obvious way to solve it right away. But if you know some basic translations of of words into math, it can get you through you know some problems or make it a little easier. So let's take a look here. Um, anytime you see the word what in a problem or how many, that's just pretty much our unknown. So we're, that's x. Um, see the words per or two, those words mean uh, divide. Uh, the word of means to multiply. If you see the word is or was, that's the same thing as an equal sign. Then if you see the phrase what percent, well we already know what is x per is divide, and cent is 100. So I'll just give you a quick example. If we had a problem that said, um, you know, 15 is what percent, let's say 15 is what percent of 75? Well, using our translation skills, we want to go from right, or sorry, <laughs> left to right. So 15 is is an equal sign what is x per cent of multiply 75 and at this point we actually have a nice little equation we can just solve you know it makes it way easier um, than deciding you know what formula to use or you know how to set it up we just translate literally so we end up with 15 equals 75 x over 100 multiply both sides by 100 then we're going to get 1500 equals 75 x and to me it looks like x is going to be 20 so just a little basic translation skill for you